Hello, I'm Graham Williams and I have the privilege of being Warden here at Newborough, one of the finest sand dune systems in the UK. It's a place that is very important for wildlife, but also very important for people in terms of its resources for horse riding, bikes, walking, the iconic landscapes of Inishkanwin and here on the dunes. It's a place which is, as I said, very important for people, but also for wildlife. Unfortunately, a number of these species are now in trouble. Over the last 50 years here at Newborough, we have seen a catastrophic decline in the number of species. That's mainly because of a decline in bare sand habitat across the site. We'll be undertaking some restoration work here at Newborough by firstly removing some of the grasses which are choking up the dunes here. And like you see behind us here, undertaking the excavations of notches. These notches will permit sand, aided by the wind, to blow further inland and will help a number of rare sand dune species which are um, at the brink of extinction here at Ufra. Behind me is an area which was previously planted where we've removed the crop and then subsequently in selected areas removed the stumps. A layer of needle litter was also removed to remobilize and re-expose areas of bare sand. Through this, we will hope now, in the next coming years, to restore this and to see a suite of rare wildlife returning to this area. We've been undertaking a lot of innovative dune management projects of late, but for decades we've been managing these sand dunes. A carefully managed programme of grazing in parts of the dunes, mostly with ponies and cattle provides the best habitat for a wide range of wildlife on the site and provides a spectacular display of flowering plants in spring and summer. It's not just the wildlife of the area which will benefit from the work. Naturally mobile sand dunes at Newborough and other places provide a more dynamic coastal defence system which can adapt to storms and rising sea levels. But it's not just the dunes and the wildlife which are important here. This Corsican pine plantation behind me was planted during the 1940s and 1950s for timber production, for work for men returning from the war and to stabilise these dunes. A network of crisscross paths around this area provides a valuable resource for recreation and also the wildlife within here is particularly rich, particularly for the red squirrel. We've done a lot here at Newborough for wildlife, but also we put a lot of infrastructure here for people. Here at the main forest car park we've made some improvements and the facilities around now ensure that people are comfortable and have a good day out here on site. The sand dune system here at Newborough has evolved dramatically over the last millennia and will continue to do so into the future. By managing appropriately the features of interest, the people here and all the things that make this such a wonderful place will ensure that it remains so for the future. 